Hey there, Orlena Kane here. I'm at Nutrition House in the Quinney Mall. I have been invited uh, to have my blood analyzed, and uh, I know Sean Kelly and Tom Smith are probably like for my head to be analyzed, but today we're just going to go with blood. I'm here with Shelly. She is a nutritionist that can help you get back on track if you have uh, any kind of problems. She can find out using your red, or your red and white blood cells as a guiding point too. So it's pretty amazing. And I'm here with Shelly. Say hello, Shelly. Hi. <laughs> All right. So Shelly, uh, you've been doing this for how many years now? Um, about four years. Mm -hmm. um, doing the live cell microscopy the clinics around Eastern Ontario. Um, but as a nutritionist, I've been working with people for upwards of 17 years now. Yeah. Now from blood, you can find out a lot of things. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The blood, um, it, it never lies. It's always what is there is there. Yeah. Um, it's the red blood cells will show deficiencies of certain vitamins and minerals and cofactors yeah. based on its shape, how it moves, based on the membrane and the, sh and, and the integrity of the membrane. Mm -hmm. um, we can also tell uh, whether, the, whether it's a mineral deficiency mm -hmm. or a macro mineral right. or a micro mineral, whether it's water soluble, fat soluble mm -hmm. problems. And then there's issues in the plasma, which is the solution that mm -hmm. the red blood cells and your white blood cells will flow through. Right. And then we can find different things there, like inflammation mm -hmm. markers. Your immune system will be in the plasma, so we can tell to make sure that your immune system yeah. is functioning properly yeah. um, and it's active. And uh, I mean, I just having my blood, uh, you know, analyzed in that, what did you discover from looking at uh, my blood cells? Okay. Well, we discovered that... Um, you, did, you had a fairly good reading, mm -hmm. um, so you can tell that the food that you're eating is, is working and it's mm -hmm. doing its job, but we did discover that you're having a little bit of a problem digesting your food, mm -hmm. and that could be from several reasons. Like we did discuss certain blood types have certain, mm -hmm. you know, preconceived mm -hmm. issues and, um, and some have a stronger constitution than others, but your particular blood type is, is, is where there's problems digesting foods and, and high stress jobs. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, can actually cause digestive problems. Wow. And so you just need a little bit of help getting mm -hmm. getting the foods broken down into smaller pieces so that they can become bioavailable for your body to absorb them. Right. And that's the key. We are what we absorb, mm -hmm. not necessarily what we eat. Gotcha. So now you suggested uh, enzymes, which I'm going to pick up today. And yeah. as well, um, omega omegas are getting a lot of talk, and they have been for a couple of years now. Uh, how important are they? More important than vitamins. Wow. Yeah more important. They, vitamins are easily got from your foods. They're found in lots of your fresh fruits and vegetables and we try, all of us try as best as we can to eat as well as we can. Mm -hmm. So we can have, you know, a good source of vitamins and minerals, but the good fats which are found in fish and nuts and seeds and, and good quality eggs and so forth, they're a little bit harder to mm -hmm. get because we don't eat high quantities of these foods. Right. But recent research has proved that that they're they're very very important for cognitive ability for proper eyesight for right. skin and when I mean skin I mean all of the skin including the tendons and the ligaments and so forth that's inside of us that we don't see wow. and then it's very good for the heart um, mm -hmm. and it's, it's it's good for women love it for nail skin and hair so that's so, good yeah. yeah so sometimes it's not just a good haircut sometimes it's your omegas can give yeah, you actually yeah. better for and, your skin and, and hair kids too right now are showing huge deficiencies omegas where they're having issues in schools where I can actually see in the blood where there's a problem wow and that can help them with their with their school and everything pretty amazing all right so Shelly's not here every single day so you can't come down but we will note the times and dates coming up on our mixed morning crew blog just below the video uh, you can have a look for all the details I'm Orlando Kane live here at Nutrition House in the Quitting Mall